Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Lauren again. Today we're gonna to be going over a new Samsung front load special buy. We're gonna be lower than anyone else on the market on this one. This is a brand new Samsung bespoke model. Really excited to show you guys this. This is the Samsung WF46BB6700 in the nice blue bespoke color. Now we got a special buy on these. We got limited quantities and once we sell out, we're gonna be out. But let's get into it, kind of the new line on bespoke. They have a lot of different models that are coming out with different color schemes. They're getting really innovative with how they look. You could choose your laundry and customize it to your life, pretty cool. But let's go into the unit itself. So, real, real quick up front here, really sleek design. Glass front, it's got a, like a tempered glass door. So it looks from a, if you have a spot where this laundry visible, um, or if you're hosting people, this looks really nice having to be able to see that tempered glass. And it looks really simple on the front here. Um, it's kind of actually more complicated than you think, but it has some type of AI technology that I'll get into. But first, just kind of rotating through the cycles here. This is more of a digital machine here. Normal, 45 minute wash. Heavy duty, longer cycle is gonna be one hour and 59 sec or minutes. And then super speed, pretty cool feature on this. This is gonna be 28 minutes. Super fast on how long it can do a super load. It's not gonna wash it super, super clean, but if you just have something you wanna just give it a quick wash through because you have to wear it fast, you don't have a whole time to wait for a whole cycle for all the washing and the dry, you can do 28 minute wash. Uh, but besides that, we're gonna have small load, delicates, steam whites, steam sanitize, steam normal, towels, bedding, active wear, colors, rinse and spin, self-clean, which I think is a longer cycle there, about four hours, yeah, three hours and 52 minutes. But really cool, um, kind of all those features packed in there, but what it actually has is AI technology. So you could connect this to your phone and it's actually gonna learn what cycles you use the most and you can actually make customizations on those cycles based off of what you have there. So pretty cool being able to change, maybe if you wanna do a hotter temperature that you, then you typically wanna add hot in there on a typical cold cycle or whatever it might be for a normal load, you could actually change that setting from there and it'll kinda of learn what settings you like so you don't have to change it every single time. So pretty cool feature. Uh, also, if you have a tight space, they kind of designed these for space. You notice that these ones don't really have a big bow out on the front, like on some of the other machines that we see here. They really thought about space on this. A lot of Americans now are living kind of tighter space, tighter zones and kind of where they're trying to live. So they're trying to pack as much as you can into these units and still fit them in a tighter spaces. Um, if you stack these, this is one of my favorite features. If you have to stack your washer and dryer, you can stack your dryer on top, obviously, but you could control both the dryer and the washer from one section. So you're not reaching all the way up here trying to control your dryer to change your setting. You could, you could control the, the controls from the dryer or the washer and you can see it's kind of labeled dryer or washer there. This one also connects to your phone like I said before. So if you want a notification that the washer is done, it'll kind of beep at your phone let you know, hey, it's done. Uh, or you could do a scheduled delay. There's all kinds of sorts of things you could do with the Samsung app that connects to this. Really cool feature. But thanks for watching guys, and we're gonna be kind of focusing on our new Samsung line, the whole Samsung 2023 line, where the next video is gonna break down kind of all the models that we've looked at and that they're gonna have for the 2023 timeframe. So thanks for watching guys, and we'll see you next week.